Welcome to the second part of the presentation. Let's talk about serum presets. 17 different categories. Let's go through them briefly. The first five sounds are juicy 808s. The next five are basses perfect for breaks. Then we have two FM basses, great for builds and producing drum and bass and dubstep. More FM basses can be found in my poison pack. The next six are pluck basses. The next six are Reese basses, very commonly used in various genres. Next, we have three sub basses and 12 bass sustains, similar to Reese basses. Then, we have nine chords, regular, LFO, and in various styles. There's also one FX, which was difficult to assign to any group, so it ends up in this category. I think it's an interesting sound. Next, we have five growls that work great if you want to add a dubstep touch to your track. Next are eight natural instruments with additional effects, three guitars and five kalimbas. Then we have 20 lead suggestions. Next are five lead percussions, similar to samples but with additional effects. Then I added three noises. Two of them are from the Bass Madness pack. If something is good, there's no need to change it. I only added one new noise, which is crowd noise. Next, we have 12 plucks. I use them not only in breaks but also in drops. The next three are stabs. I wanted to solve a problem that kept bothering me when sampling stabs. Now you can easily layer your bass with one of the stabs. The last group is vocal shots. We have 10 of them. Perfect for future bass and melodic genres, as well as an additional lead layer. You can find a better presentation of these sounds in the intro video. I'll go over these sounds quickly now.